Welcome to the Becker County Master Gardeners Rambling Rose. Uh, so glad to be with you today. Today we're down at the city park. It's Memorial Weekend and we're having the annual plant sale for the Master Gardeners. And one of the things we have um, on the plant sale today is kale. And kale has become the one vegetable, one community um, project for Detroit Lakes this year. And Marsha Parker is here with me, um, one of our Master Gardeners, and she um, works at Essentia Health and she is part of this program so she's going to explain more about the One Vegetable, One Community program. One Vegetable, One Community um, came out of a meeting that was held this past winter where people throughout the community, um, health care providers, farmers, uh, restaurant owners got together to look at how could we promote eating more produce, more locally grown foods. And one of the things that came from it was one vegetable, one community. And so we chose the vegetable kale as our vegetable that we're promoting throughout Detroit Lakes this summer. And so we put together 500 packets with kale seeds, um, planting instructions and recipes that have been um, distributed throughout Detroit Lakes from, from banks to the chamber, handing them out at the clinic, at the Essential Health Clinic, um, prices jewelry, so that people could start uh, planting their kale and then there'll be um, many more uh, promotional ideas go, uh, focused on kale, like a food demo at the farmer's market using kale because it's a great uh, vegetable that you can make kale chips out of, kale salad, you can put kale in soup, you can stir fry it. So it's real versatile and has lots of uses. Um, we're also doing um, something that's called a passport. So if you go to uh, Central Market and buy their kale salad, you'll get a stamp on your passport. If you buy kale at the farmer's market, you'll get a stamp on your passport. Or if you go to La Barista, because they'll be featuring kale, you'll also get a stamp on your passport. And then you can turn that in, and I believe that then there'll be a drawing for a winner, because we're really trying to promote eating locally grown healthy foods. Um, and can you grow these, it can be in your garden, but you could grow it in a pot too, right? That's right. A lot of the local businesses, this. Um, summer will have kale in their planters so when you're going downtown and you're uh, checking out the beautiful flowers that are in the different pots in front of businesses look for kale because many of them will have kale tucked into their their planters well that's a neat idea mm -hmm. that's a really neat idea and I was reading instructions on planting and it says plant about 18 inches apart so they are going to get quite large aren't yeah, they, they? Yeah, there's all different so. types of kale. There's dinosaur kale that gets very big leaves to some of the smaller ones. So um, it does need some space to grow in, but you can grow it in a pot, and that's what's really handy. Mm -hmm. um, the health benefits from eating kale are just um, phenomenal. Uh, it's packed full of vitamin A, um, vitamin C, so and lots of different antioxidants. So it's really one of the superfoods that's really being promoted this year. I see there's a website. Um, where I think you can get recipes, the www.veggieoftheyear.com, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. and so it'll have it'll have lots of ideas on how to use your kale. Right, right. right. Yeah. Um, and this project really was the brainchild of SHIP, the statewide health improvement um, project, and they have many different facets to it. Not only eating healthy food, locally grown food, but they have uh, active living, you know, promoting uh, walking to school and bike paths. So just to help promote us all um, adopting a healthier lifestyle. So, okay, kale is Becker County or Detroit Lakes. That's yeah, our vegetable. That's our vegetable. Is there another, is this going happening throughout the state, do you know? Uh, well, I know in Fergus Falls, it's their second year, and they, their vegetable this year is beets. Um, and I cool. believe the program actually started in Duluth, and it's their fourth year, and they're doing squash. And so every year it's a different vegetable that's being promoted, to, just to really increase uh, the exposure and, again, to eat locally grown, healthier food and to having access to it. Okay, well, thank you so much. That was very informative. If you have more questions, um, can they call? Feel free. Yeah. If you have more questions, feel free to call uh, me. My name is Marsha Parker. I work at Essential Health St. Mary's, and my phone number is 844-8368. And they can still get seeds, right? So if they wanted to... There's a few packets okay. left, yeah. Okay. They, they've really okay. gone fast. It's amazing. Yeah, 500 good. packets wow. that were put together, wow. so it's pretty exciting. Yeah. Well, thank you. Thanks for tuning in today, and um, we'll see you again on the Becker County Master Gardener's Rambling Rose. Thank you.